Third kind of Shah, Rav Shalul says that there is one God and one mediator between God and man, the man, Mashiach Yeshua, who he says gave himself a ransom for all to be testified in due times. Now I wanted to go out there to say to somebody who would tell me that I've been sold a bill of goods. Now I would tell you that my Jewish mother read the entire Bible, the Tanakh and the Brit Kadashah, and she understood what it said and she gave her life and she was ready to go when the time came. And I say that she prayed for me for a while. I was like, like uh, Samson. That remember when God had his mother to uh, take the Nazarite vow so that he would not, uh, that he would come back to the Lord uh, after, after he saw what he reaped uh, in his sowing. And so that I follow, followed in her footsteps and understood what, what, uh, what I need, you know, that we all need to make our peace with God. And I asked one day, I read the, what people said about Yeshua, and I asked one question. If he is the Messiah, and I just didn't take a bill of goods, but the question is, if he is the Messiah, well then, uh, why was there all this persecution, all this work against the Jewish people, Jewish people disc being discriminated by so-called uh, believers. And why didn't the Jewish people believe? Well, let's answer this. Uh, the Jewish leaders at the time of the Roman conquest wanted to believe that there would be a Messiah who would overthrow the Roman Empire and then come and die in battle. And they had it all wrong. They wanted to make two Messiahs. There was only one Messiah. And when you read your scriptures, it stands to reason that he had to uh, deal with sin first. Because what happened, it was in the fall of the garden, his atonement was being re re uh, revealed uh, when Adam and Eve uh, disobeyed the commandment. And as for why was all this uh, uh, persecution, discrimination? Well, one thing, not everybody who says they're a believer is a believer. Uh, Yeshua said there would be false prophets in the, day, in the days that he, uh, before he would come. A lot of these people were not really believers. Not everybody who calls himself a says they believe believe. A lot of people who did the people who did this these acts against Jewish people uh, did it all in spite of everything that he said, did, and taught, and not because of it. And somebody would say to me, "I'm greatly confused." And that one who I remember said that seemed to be confused herself. Because all you have to do is read the scriptures. And, you know, uh, your, your guidance, your moral compass, it'll all be from the scriptures. So, uh, don't just tell me that I, I've uh, been fed a bill of goods. Read the scriptures.